Police were speculating that O'Brien's motive was to lace the candy with poison in effort to collect the money from the life insurance policies he had taken out on his children. But O'Brien insisted that he was innocent. A reverend by the name of Carol Pickett, who was formerly a chaplain at the Texas Department of Criminal Justice, stated that O'Brien was hated by his fellow inmates after learning what he did to his own child and had no friends whatsoever. The inmates had petitioned to hold an organized demonstration on his execution date to express their hate for him. O'Brien's first execution date was set for August 8, 1980. He then had his second date scheduled for May 25, 1982, after his attorney petitioned for stay of execution, meaning to delay in carrying out the court order. He again had that date postponed. His third execution date...